Okay, so for today's video it's going to be a bit different. We're going to be making a PS1 mod. As you can see, this is my original PS1, the one that I would normally use in the videos, but we're going to mod my second PS1. I actually have two. So, as you can see, this one is straight up stock original and it has the laser and everything. But the one we are going to do today is this one. It's about to come on camera. This one. As you can see, if I open the tray, you can see it has an X Station mod. And all my games are saved onto the SD card. And on this one, we even have an updated power supply so it can work in any country. And in today's uh, World 2023, we need to future proof this. So that's done, but what mod are we doing? Let me show you. The one we are going to do is. Uh, a shell we swap and it's going to be a black shell so I will show you it so it's not painted it's actually black and uh, yeah that feels so nice there's no logo here but I do have some other PS1s here that we can just this is a broken one that is uh, just no use yellowed I will take off the logo and I will stick it inside but yeah, that's today's video, that's the plan. Okay, so now we're at the work desk. Yeah, we are going to just shell, swap everything. As you can see, this is a 5000 model. Uh, we don't have the sticker on the back, so I will take. I will try to take that off using isopropyl and then re-stick it on to the new shell. But let's get started. So we need to take out the back screws first. So, uh, the oh, screws are out. I'm going to be careful here. So I want to see when I take it off. And that's it pretty much. It's uh, very clean some rust on this piece but it's not a big deal so anyway okay and you can see the power supply this is the upgraded one the better one and we are going to yeah we so we'll move the power supply over first I think that's probably the better choice so let's do that and then after that we will move on to the guts of the computer Okay, so we got that there. Uh, we just unplug the power itself here. That should just come off. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to see how it would fit in from the other one. Does that just clip down or not? Um, sorry, just hold on, bear with me. Okay, so we got it. It was just a bit of a tight fit because the plastic is so new. So yeah, we're good to go. So we're gonna screw those two back in and then we're gonna continue with the organ transplant. Okay, so that's done. Power supply is good to go. And now we are gonna work on to the next part, which really should be the, the front two parts so um, how does that come loose does that come off on the board or does that come off let me see yeah that will come off on the board so you can kind of just disconnect it from the board give it a very very loose wiggle don't rip it out I've heard stories where people have ripped off the connector from the board by pulling too hard All right, let's see how that looks with the, the lid on the top. I mean, yeah, it's good, it's nice. But if that was black, it would be better, of course, but uh, that can be on another video, another time. Yeah, 
that's nice. It's cool. All right, so the next part, just a moment. All right, so next part is to take out the whole board. Oh, we should take this off first, actually. So I'm gonna take out the SD card so I don't accidentally damage that. I'm gonna put it up there, out the way. Take off the 3D printed part and well, there's the mod, really. So we need to take off the mod first, or it's just going to be connected like this, so... We just very carefully loosen the ribbon, and that will just drop out. Put that up there, take the 3D printed bracket, so there should only be in here. When I bought the mod, only two screws, so we got up here one. And over here two, and that will lift off the entire top of this okay so it's come loose it was just stuck on so we are to take that off and i mean that's this is i, I already put this in vinegar but there's still a bit of rust coming back here and here i'll have to fix that but we'll not do that today i will do that off camera uh, i've got a dremel i can maybe just scrub that off but at the moment that is okay I will change that later I don't like that because if you, a little bit of rust can eat into the board that's not a good thing anyway so now we are down to the board itself the actual uh, X station is underneath where this ribbon would be now I'm not sure did I put any more screws in or does it just come off oh yeah this over here okay one here the guy that gave me this literally took all the screws didn't put all the screws back in but it kind of doesn't matter you don't need them all in if it's not like necessary and that's it so that's a bit yucky you see you don't want that you don't want to deal with that it's not good news so the whole thing should just drop back in boom like that perfect and then what are we doing wait I put that screw here okay so I really I really should have threaded that hole but I'm in the wrong hole <laughs> no pun intended uh, it's up here. So just screw that down. Oops. You hold it from the bottom. Alright, so that's in. It's looking good. Secure. Uh, we put the metal back on. Carefully. This ribbon should just go through here. And then that will clip all back on once it's in. So let me just push this down carefully off camera because I need to be closer. Alright, so now this is on well. So we're going to put the other two screws back in. And again, like I said, it likely needs to be re-threaded here. So you want to hold it as straight as possible so you don't go in like sideways. That is not straight. Like I'm saying, uh, even on the original plastic, I couldn't really screw it properly. You try to get it right. Let me see. You can see here, it's it's not straight. But it's clipped on. So, what do we do here? Just ram it in. If I get the first one there. Hmm. All right, it's, it's going. Alright, that one's done, that's good. Next one. This one's troublesome, doesn't want to go down, you see, it's uh let me take a look at that. Alright, so that's the first problem that we found. So this one here is meant to be this one here. 
So, uh, looking at the board, I can. I got one up here, which is up here. So this one here, I could go with that one, or I can't go there. Let's just see if I'd flip this over. Yeah, it's a corner, so I can't go here because that is here. Um, but we need. I need two in. If it's it's really meant to be there to hold the whole thing down in case you flip it upside down, which is probably never going to happen. I mean, there's is here I can possibly go to like if you just put them there that should be okay I mean that's gonna hold it down so I can either go here or here I'm gonna try both but I th that's not held down I mean it's it's here or here really this is further away so I, I think there will be more support I put it here. That's the thing about printing new uh, new shells. It's never going to be exact. Alright, so that's good enough. I mean, that that will do it. Is that in focus? So I'm checking my camera. Alright, so we we are currently almost done. The biggest worry is when you boot it up. Is it actually going to work? <laughs> Uh, the hardest part is not done yet by the way we gotta put on the ps logo so i will do that off camera i don't think you want to see me do that so that will go on here like so that should if i remember was like that right and then this i can't even remember i think it was like that i couldn't tell you. Uh, we'll put this in first, the actual X station. Bear with me for a moment. Let me do this off camera. It's being complicated. Okay, so that's done. Um, I guess it was like this and this. Then it was this, I think. I think that's correct. You will know when we put the lid on. <laughs> yes, perfect. And then SD card. Here's the part I worry about. Okay, here's the part I worry about is will anything rattle carefully. And then we're going to put in the six screws and then off camera I will put on all the stickers and then we will be back after that. So I'm going to do this now, I'm going to cut the camera and then when we come back I will be done with everything else.